Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Lee Dixon and a potentially exciting occasion on the cup front. It's Sao Paulo and they face the New York Red Bulls. Well, I suppose at this stage in the tournament you can dream about the final, but an awful lot of football to be played, an awful lot of hard work, another step towards the final. I'm really looking forward to this one, Derek. And the game begins. Casares Jr. Kaku. In position to give them the lead, maybe. And he couldn't take advantage of that opportunity from close range, Lee. How close does he want to be to score? He's gone for power and fluffed his lines. They couldn't keep it. This is looking threatening. Wonderful tackle. said and done he's failed to hit the target Using his physical strength to shield it. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. That will certainly mean a booking here. And now he's on a tightrope. Long. White, Davis, can he do it, oh and couldn't convert, Promising pass.
could play it in. It has to be! Well, he's hit it with far too much height. Well, he's quite a long way out, and if you put power on the ball and just lean back slightly, he's going to rise, and that time, over the bar. Royer, Brian White, he's in behind, it has to be surely, the opportunity was there but he got it wrongly, well even I would have scored there, he's And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is the former Arsenal defender, Lee Dixon. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. This ought to be a fantastic watch, Lee. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Welcome, everybody. What a semi-final we've got in prospect here. The travelling fans are making huge racket outside the stadium before kick-off. Really big achievement to get here, but if you go out in the semi-final, no worse place to lose. Get your focus on the final, focus on your game plan, and make sure your emotions match your ambitions. The starting 11 for Atalanta. Rafael Toloi plays alongside Mattia Caldara in central defence. And it's an interesting looking attacking constellation with three forwards listed from the start. Gomez. Excellent challenge. Yeah. 
So much to like about Alejandro Gomez. Lee, in your opinion, what will he deliver in this game? Well, yeah, when defenders look who they're playing against, they always look at the goals. Two goals in his last previous game. He's certainly a threat to them today. Masterful piece of foiling. Gradel. Fruitful looking attack. You know what? He's going to be annoyed with himself given the position he was in, Lee. Well, yeah, they worked it really well, didn't he? He's got in a position to score and not really took advantage of that. Hakan Arslan. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. This could pose problems for the defenders. But what an opportunity it was to score the first goal of the match. Well, I'm not sure he'll get a better chance than that old game. It really is a bad miss. Ilicic. Freiler in possession. And oh, that's a super ball over the top. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Zia Erdal. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. An attack full of promise. Well, decent save there. Well, he's given a corner, their referee. into the centre of the box relatively straightforward to mop up defensively and the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage can they get themselves in front here given the position he was in he's not going to be especially pleased with himself well he took the chance with power not always the best option Remo Freuler. Gomez. Alejandro Gomez has it. Well, he's lost it. Nice looking pass. And he's in an offside position.
Gomez. Martin Derone on the offensive. But a pass that lacks quality. Playing with purpose and control. Chances on. Can he apply the finish? Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Lost possession. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Zia Erdal. Hakan Arslan. Possession lost. Duvan Zapata. Now can they counter clinically? Well, it petered out. Chance to play it in. In position. Well, the attack showed promise, but easy work for the keeper in the end. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Martin Deron. Losing possession a bit easily. Fruitful looking attack. And a good looking ball. And cleared away.
And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, joined in the commentary position by Lee Dixon. And a potentially exciting occasion on the cup front. It's Universidad Católica and they take on Tajeres. Well, I do love my league football, but when I was a player, I looked forward to cup competitions. But that road to the final starts with games like this. It's going to be a cracker. Nerves as well. You don't want to get knocked out at this stage. Juan Comar. Could play it in. The keeper was up to the task. Well, it's a decent effort, but it's a real opportunity goes begging there. Over the touchline for a throw in. Pochettino, Juan Comar, and now Moreno. Can they create something from here? Went in strongly, decisively. Gaston Lescano, and a chance for him on the flank. Oh, what an opportunity! There it is, and just the ideal start. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging for someone to get on the end of it. And from there, the soft cushion volley is an absolute dream. I love this goal. One nil then. And a throw in it's going to be. Edson Putsch. San Pedri. Here's Cesar Pinares. It might be on for them. Regain possession. Well, the timing a little bit off. Jose Pedro Fuenzalida. It is a decent looking attack here. Flag up, tight offside. Diaz Bustos Oh, nice ball over the top to chase Luciano Awed Zampedri And the counter-attack is on Options available They did have the ball, but not anymore.
So after that, a goal kick it'll be. And that's an important intervention. Disappointing pass. Opportunity in the wide area. A real opening now. And still looking for space. I must say, he's let himself down with really flabby finishing there. Yeah, he wasted opportunity from the short distance. You see the manager's frustration on the touchline. Well, couldn't keep it. Luciano Awed. Good-looking sequence. And a tidy challenge. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And there's nothing quite like the magic of a cup competition. Live action coming up for you. It's Atletico Paranaense facing Salzburg. Well, I do love my league football, but when I was a player, I looked forward to cup competitions. Well, that road to the final starts with games like this. It's going to be a cracker. Nerves as well. You don't want to get knocked out at this stage.
Koita. And the emphasis is on creativity. And in with a real chance. Must score. Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, snuffing out the danger, but a corner coming up. And now the delivery. And a goal! Right off the bat! No wonder they're jumping for joy! Well, as we see again, Derek, it's quite simple. Keep the ball, don't give it away. It's a terrible clearance. And after that, they're under pressure and they never recover. Bad goals give away. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. And can they prize them open now? Committed challenge. He's in with a chance. He saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves. Great goalkeeping. Well, he's denied a certain goal there. Great reflexes from the keeper. Favouring the short one. Targets available. Cross comes in. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Now can they counter clinically? And room now out on the flank. Real chance. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. And a tidy ball. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Space and time for the cross. And able to get a body in the way. Tries to lift it. Wonderful chip. Superb save. Well, the keeper gambled coming off his line, but it paid off. And breaking at pace with Menace. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Seku Koita. Well, he's lost it. Might really be able to trouble them here. Well, that is a moment he would like to airbrush from history. Well, he's had an absolute nightmare there. The goal's in front of him. Just hit it. Andre Ramaglio. And Christensen has it. Okugawa. Christensen. Mwepu spraying passes around almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake Seku Koita and he's made headway he had just the goalkeeper to beat he's got it completely wrongly well he won't be watching that when he gets home tonight on a replay
playing with purpose and control. Straight forward for the keeper. Well, just look at the stats up there. They really haven't created enough. Not tested the goalkeeper, not tested the defence. Mind you, only takes one little mistake and they could get back into this game. And players waiting in the centre, foiling them effectively. Wide of the target and he's going to be disappointed. Disappointed, wow, it's a shocker. He should be doing a lot, lot better than that. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages.